What's up guys, Tori here of Love Tori Beauty and check it out, I have Senegalese twist and I have to tell you I was super excited about trying this style. The first thing I did before I committed to it was I tried it myself. I did my twist. Um, some stayed in, some slipped out and eventually I will make a video to show you how I put them in but once I knew that I liked them, I said hey why not? I'm going to pay to get this professionally done. I'm going to insert a picture here. This is how they turned out when I did them. And like I said, I really, really liked them. And so I said, why not? I'm going to go and let someone else do them. So my experience with the twists was fantastic. I got to try a lot of different styles. I'm going to insert some pictures right here of all the styles that I tried. So as you can see, there are a lot of different things that you can do with them. They're really light. The lady who did mine, you know, she started from the top and when she got in the bottom of the twist, she sheared them. So they're very, very lightweight. This is considered the medium style. Um, what else can I tell you? Oh, they make mornings really, really easy. You just get up and go. But there are a couple of products that I want to tell you about that will help to keep your style looking nice and neat. Right now, these twists are about three weeks old. Is this? This is my edge control hair gel. I use this to smooth out my edges with my twist. Because my hair sometimes tends to kind of want to come out of the braid. So I did use the Eco Styler Styling Gel for curly and wavy hair. It's what, $2.50 and it works. Salon Pro Braid Sheen. My own homemade formula. Basically I used the Dark and Lovely Leave-In Conditioner, Marula Curl Oil, Jojoba Oil, Argan Oil, just a nice mashup of different oils. And I would spray this on my twist. Uh, from root to tip. I was really impressed with this one. Um, it says it soothes dry scalp and helps relieve itching and it really does work and this one I think was about three dollars at my local beauty supply store so I would highly highly recommend this spray if you are considering twists or braids. So cons. Well I wasn't used to braids so the first three days it felt very very tight. It was uncomfortable to sleep. Um, that's the only con. Once they loosened up, I loved them. I liked wearing them up. I liked twisting them and pulling it back. The, the possibilities were just endless and I got so many compliments on them. So if you're looking for something new to try or maybe you've had braids but you wanna try twists, I would definitely recommend it. Um, when I did it myself after I took it out, my hair had no damage. In fact, it was soft and I would have worn it right on into a twist out except for it really needed to be washed. Um, this took four hours in case you're wondering and I just wanna show you too, you know, front and back how wonderful of a job the lady who braided it uh, did. So I just used regular braiding hair, $2.49 by Biba. This is the number 4 and 30. It comes pre-mixed together. I would also recommend the Motown Tresses hair as well. I think it's 3 bucks at your local beauty supply store. Um, so I definitely will try the twist again. I'm going to make a video where I show you how to install them. It's not difficult at all. Um, the lady who did mine, I don't know if you could see this, but basically she braided at the top and then twisted going down. The way I learned it right from YouTube was to basically take a strand of hair, take your braiding hair, twist one side forward and the other the other way. So you're basically doing this kind of a motion and then you crisscross and I'll be showing you that. Oh, and the ends. What I like about this hair is by dipping it in boiling water for about 30 seconds, you can change how you want the bottom to look. So I changed it from straight. If you noticed in the pictures that I showed you earlier, it was wavy. She simply braided it all together, all the way down to the ends, and then she dipped that in into the boiling water when she unbraided it, it was wavy. You can use perm rods and then dip it in the boiling water and it'll be curly. But personally, I just prefer the straight. And 
I just love them. I hate to take them out, but I want to give my scalp a little TLC. So uh, thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next video. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Bye.